Morning, everybody. It's time for the Coming Out Tarot Intention of the Day. If you've been here before, welcome back. If you haven't, thanks for watching this on the replay. And my name is Seth. I run ComingOutTarot.com. You can always find out more about me over there. Uh, the Tarot Intention of the Day, Hey Meganopolis, is a way for you to approach your day with mindfulness, thoughtfulness, and awareness so that you're going through your day with some actionable advice that you can use to move the outcome of the events that occurred during the course of your day like these little wispy hairs, <laughs> in the direction that you'd like them to go. So that's the point of the intention of the day. Hey Geneva, if you're not quite sure what to do with that, I definitely recommend checking it out at the end of the day. Think about those events that did occur during the course of your day, morning wake up happy, and how if you had applied the intention of the day that I'm about to give you, you could have actually moved those events in the direction that you'd like them to go. So that's a way that you can start to work with it. Uh, the card that I've drawn for today from my trusty handle deck, thanks wake up, is the Empress. This is my I'm Every Woman card, Whitney Houston, not Shaka Khan. I'm every woman. Uh, what's important to me today is actually the rune or crystal that is above her head and that big eyeball and the triangle up at the top. They're working in concert together, uh, which to me, I know, right? No fool. And uh, somebody else drew the fool on Saturday. Somebody that I follow drew the fool on Saturday. Craziness about the fool last week. Um, we're still in majors though, and we've moved from the fool into the empress. The, uh, oh no, Meganopolis, I hope you're getting that shit together. Um, today is really about what's possible and how you can make things happen for yourself, which maybe may not be the best news for Meganopolis. Um, but it's how you can make things happen for yourself. There's a lot of introspection, meditation, working from a spiritual side, whatever it is that moves you, uh, whether you're uh, someone who fits into organized religion, spiritualism, atheism, whatever, whatever it is that moves you forward, whatever that ritual and practices that can move you forward, that can help create the abundance that you're looking for, it's about anything is possible as long as you find the way to make it happen. So uh, what the most impressive part of that is, is that anything is possible. The hard part is, hey yoga, is that you got to sit with yourself and figure out how to make that happen. You may need to spend a little time introspectively, or you may be moving in a place of just plowing ahead and getting things done. It could be either side of that coin. So all up to you, sit, da sit back, do some focus, do whatever ritual is important to you to figure out what it is you need to focus on, and then um, either continue to sit back and focus or start to plow ahead. It's one of those two things. So I hope that's helpful. If it is, please share it with everybody. Please pass it on so everybody can benefit from the intention of the day. And then uh, let me know how it goes. Let me know what the intention uh, has done for you, if you forgot about it, if you remember to put it into practice, any of that stuff. I'd love to hear about it. You can let me know on on any social media channel at Coming Out Tarot. I'll have the video up on YouTube in a little bit. I'll have the image over on Instagram in a little bit. And tonight I will have the, uh, <laughs> tonight I'll have it pop up on Facebook as a reminder just to reflect on your day at about five o'clock central. So everybody have a great Monday and I will see you all later.